Hello and welcome back to Dragon Age Origins. We are currently at Red uh, Lake Callanhad, so then we can put a box in a building. Yeah! There we go. This should be easy enough. We place a deserved payment in the place. And I think there's one more. One outside Orzammar. Yep. Oh, well, we're heading there next anyway. Hey, innkeeper, I forgot to tell you our deal dealt with those Welcome slugs. back to the spoiled princess. How may I serve you today? Oh, okay then. Of course. Why do you still have the thing above your head? Are you broken? Why did I... I didn't do that. I just wanted to look at it. Not put down another one. Watch out for foes with coloured names. You might need new strategies to defeat these powerful opponents. Right, we are going to be heading to camp. Because we need to get a new party, which we're taking to Orzammar. Yee, new people! Because a few people have, have some things to do here anyway. <laughs> Why, you itchy arm. Um, let's equip some new people. Small clear, small clear. Nothing else. You can't have that kind of stuff. Okay, next. You can't have any of that. Go. Ooh. Yeah, have that. Right, now you can have some cool stuff. You can have this. Wait, which one was that? Drake skin. Skin. Take them all. 230, 15%, 10%, 4% fatigue. Yeah, this is better. Any helmet? No. Okay. Uh, you can't equip any of that because you suck. And you can have. Alright, next. Sten. Sten, my boy. Why do you have that? You need this. Um, and that's it. That's all you need. Okay, Morrigan. You can have... Well, actually, you've got a good thing on anyway, so you don't need any more. Ashing gloves. 20% cold damage. Electricity resistance. Electricity damage. Now yeah, we'll keep the cold. Marathon, um, okay, then you don't need anything else. And you've already got stuff on. Here we go. Now we just level up everyone that needs leveling up. You first. Where are you? Spirit healer! Gimme, gimme, gimme. Oh crap. Is that it? That was it. You can... I'm waiting till I get Berserker for him. Because that would give me two strength and plus ten health and then Sten would be unstoppable. Uh, we should put it in Dexterity because you need a little defense and the rest of strength. We need more strength. Up shale, because sh shale's got a lot of stuff. Um, there we go, 40 constitution. She's. Oh, uh, shale's gonna be basically like. a tank. something. I don't know. And then. dexterity. Right, killing blow. Shale concentrates all remaining energy into one tremendous blow. If the attack connects, it is an automatic critical hit, but Shale's remaining stamina is drained and added to the attack damage. After learning this talent, Shale gains a greater bonus to damage whenever pulverizing blows are done. Huh. Earth in grass, Shale pounds the earth, mobilizing enemies, and lets the pass resist physical resistance check. After learning this talent, Shale re receives a Shale greater bonus against missile attacks whenever rock mercenary is active. 
Whenever stone aura is active, shield gains additional bonuses to armor and resist hostile spells. Party members within aura gain additional bonuses to attack, stamina regeneration, critical chance, and armor penetration. Enemies who enter the aura suffer penalties to movement, speed, attack, and defense. Damn! <laughs> getting that. Shale's like overpowered. Supernatural resilience. Whenever stone aura is active, wait, what is stone aura? Activates a support mode that imbues nearby party members with bonuses to attack, defense, and health generation with other talents in the chain. Shale gains bonuses to armor and resist to hostile spells. However, the aura paralyzes Shale and imposes a personal penalty to defense as well as draining stamina. With renewed assault, nearby enemies suffer penalties to attack and defense. So she can, Shale can use it, but she, he he won't be able to move or do anything. I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing. And I think damaging all nearby enemies. Okay, bonus is damage generation when stone heart is active. We'll do that. Oh, wait, dog. Or Bob, as I called him. Yay, shred. And then Zevran, you can have it in your... We need constitution, you hardly have any. And the rest in cunning, yeah. Put it in that. And then... Put it in that. Now Sten. Oh yeah, you can't. Never mind. Reset. Oh, wait, no, not reset. Is that everyone? Well, Sten obviously because can't do anything with it. Nope, that's everything. Whee! Now we're gonna sell some crap. You and your friends are formidable Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. sure you'll be pleased. You can have that. Blur. You can also have this because it's not good for anyone anymore. Have that because I can't use it. E Asturian might. I want that, but I need higher strength. And I want to use that, but I need higher strength. So you can take the Grey Warden Scout helmet, Grey Warden Scout gloves. Horse cut gauntlets because no one's going to use them. Cut those. And the storm talons. And this. And the grey ones. And. Rinner's armor. Cultist leather armor. Dynamizers. Keep that. Armor of diligence. Warden commander plates. Keep that. Uh, sell these because we're not even going to use them. Then sell that. Lots of stuff getting sold, yay! Spell, but it's rendered useless after us. Yeah, sure, give me that. Where else you got? Um, ugly boots, lesion mass. Okay. We can sell. Oh, here we go. I don't want to keep these in my items because they're just useless. And that's it. Okay, we're going to stop here in the next episode. We're going to. Either we're gonna to talk to everyone and then we're gonna see if they need to say anything and if not then we just leave. And probably items too.